Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Say that one more time. We've just realised that the hay was <sighs> brought on. in by you. Well. And you know what? It's stuck. Well, you know, uh, I'm a poet and I do know it. Yeah. As they would say. It also gets sometimes added like we do a hey! Okay. You can do a bit a of that little reverb. Sometimes. Okay. Can do. Getting creative. Can do. <laughs> Unpopular opinion. I think solo. Okay. Come and tell us your unpopular opinion. Something up till now that you've been scared to say. Hey! Ooh, that was nice. <laughs> with, the, with the verb. <laughs> Some brand new unpopular opinions, and we start with Katie. Stale crisps are better than normal crisps. Oh, come on. That's just insane. <laughs> what? The, <laughs> what? They, they taste better than normal crisps. So no, no. My husband and I. <laughs> Why are you like the royal family? My husband and I. <laughs> my husband and I. <laughs> my husband and I wait for them to be posher than, than I am. Mm. We buy crisps, you know, like the big bags of crisps. So we go for our food shop on a Thursday mm. and then we open them, put them in the cupboard, and then by the weekend, when you're ready to eat them, they're the perfect staleness. Why? Why would you do this? <laughs> Well, cheesy puffs are the best. Cheesy puffs. For that. Oh, okay, okay. Honestly, you should so, try it. Okay, so to be fair, I think I've, there's a part of me that remembers that from when I was younger, yeah. having like a more stale what's it, and I can yeah. see more value in that than a like for example like a Walker's ready sorted. So, yeah, see yeah. that's like low end, like but, it's more like. Yeah. But you would still do it with a Walker's ready sorted. Yeah, honestly, you should try it. No, nah, nah, no, nah, no, I'm alright. No. Nah. We not forty eight hours or so, and then it's perfect. Oh, not even a young twenty four, <laughs> like old forty eight. Like she's a chef. <laughs> Open the bag, 48 hours later, <laughs> pop them in. Lovely, stale, delicious. Mm. Perfect. Gorgeous, yes. Yeah. Great start, Katie. Thank you. <laughs> Let's go again. Plenty more that came from. Oh, come, come and tell us your unpopular, unpopular opinion. opinion. Something, Something up to now that you've been scared to say. Hey, do you know what? You are changing give to tell, and I think that might, st- that might stick. Do you think tell's better? Come and give us your unpopular Come and opinion. tell us. I quite like tell, I think. Come doing... and tell us your unpopular maybe, maybe okay. that's the Come 2022. Your... Did, was you saying tell? Or was I, I say saying... give. Oh, I now tell. say tell. Come and give us. I'll... No, but I think tell's good. I'm going to go back to give. No, I want, no, I want tell. No, because then I'm going to need royalties because I've given you the hey and now the give and now uh, we're getting into a. But so if I. It's right, a grey area now. So if I start singing tell, it's the laws will be on. Way, huh? oh, right, do you know what? I'm not scared. Come and tell us your oh, unpopular no. opinion. <laughs> Something up till now that you've been Scared to say. Oh, and a hey. Write that down. <laughs> <laughs> Write that down. <laughs> okay, who's next? We've got Becky. Be real should ban people who don't post on time. Ooh, yes. What's be real? You don't know what be real is, Grandad. No. Be real is this social media app. You only have your friends on it because why would you want to see like random people? But mm. it sends you a notification once a day. And then in those two minutes that it sends a notification, you're meant to post a picture of exactly what you're doing in that moment. So the time will go off at 10 a.m. People will wait like nine hours <laughs> and then post the picture when they're actually out, like having dinner with a friend. Okay. Banned. Yeah, because it's not real. That's the thing. Be real. It's, it's quite intriguing. The clue oh, is in the name. Oh, okay, yeah. got you. So it's like, okay. In, in that moment. I agree, though, because if that's the point of the app and people aren't sticking to that, then... Mm. They should just go to Instagram, innit? And yeah, post I think whenever so. they want. But it? it's quite, it's quite stressful. Exactly. It buzzed during the show the other day. Oh, is it? Because it changes the time that it buzzes you, so ah, that you get different okay. things. And it's just like I've got, I'm busy. You have things okay. to do. Okay. And also, you could just be. No, I, like, I, like I like the idea. Of that. I like the idea. That. It should be like three strikes and you're out. <laughs> what? Yeah. And then just ejected from the app forever? Pretty much. Yeah, right, a okay. year ban, something like that. <laughs> I agree. Would you would you take a picture of it though? If you were on the toilet, Becky, at that time, would you do be be real from the bog? Do you know what? I'm not ashamed to admit it. I would. Right. Okay. Oh, but there's some situations where, come on, you can't. Absolutely. You yeah. know. You know. What's the situation? <laughs> yeah, yeah. In the shower. Well, you know. Oh. Sleeping. Sleeping. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Depends how brave you are, doesn't it? Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Stormzy, get on Be Real. I think you need to get on Be Real. We need that fearlessness. Becky, thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Becky's a bit saucy. Yeah, what was she up to there? A bit saucy, Becky. <laughs> Come and give us your opinion. Hey. Okay. Next one, let's go to Kent. And we've got Alexi. Contactless soap dispensers are pointless. You're a man after my own heart. 
What, when you go like that? Yeah, when you put it under and it just does the soap automatically, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Why do you think they're pointless? I've never thought of that. <laughs> well, if you think about it, mm. you, the reason for them is you're touching them and you're washing your hands straight afterwards. Mm -hmm. So the contactless part takes away touching. <laughs> yeah. Soap kills 99% of germs or so, they say, whatever. So your hands are going to be clean no matter what you've touched afterwards. Mm. Like, I just... I think it's a gimmick by the big corporate companies. <laughs> <laughs> you know, these overmade machines. Yeah. When I'm at work, half the time I go to one, I put my hand under it, nothing comes out. I go to the next, I put my hand under it, nothing comes out. And I'm stood there waving my hands like a maniac. <laughs> and at it's... the end of it, I'm more frustrated. I just think, bring back old fashioned soap dispensers. I do love how much it's angry. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's really, really, it's really <laughs> gotten under his skin, man. <laughs> Do you know what you should do? You should just go on a mission that like, every toilet you go into, just smash them, man. <laughs> just be, as in, just be the, the lone ranger that you need to be yeah. and just yeah. make this, make it your life mission to destroy all yeah. contactless soap dispensers. Well, destroy when it. I get caught, um, can, I, can I rely on you to sort of back me up a bit? Listen, and... Greg, Greg's got lawyer fees for me anyway because I'm stealing <laughs> my, so yeah. don't worry, I've got, I've got yeah. you. Yeah, you can throw me under the bus if you want, but what you should do is you just smash them up, but also then leave a little bar of dove next to it as well, <laughs> just so, so that people know it's like your calling card. Yeah. yeah oh yeah. God, Alexi's been here. <laughs> yeah. Alexi, thank you so much. Cheers, guys. Big up. Nice one. Let's go again. I think we'll have one more. Have right, one cool. more. This is on you. On you. On you. Come and tell us your unpopular opinion. Something that to now that you've been scared to say. Hey. hey. That was nice. Jess. Wearing black is not stylish. It's boring hey, and hey. lazy. Hey, come on. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Say that one more time. <laughs> it's just so uninspiring. <sighs> you do not see. Listen, this is coming from even... T so today I'm not in my normal all black number. Mm. I'm, I've gone... Uh, what's it? Burnt orange they've been saying I'm wearing. Lovely. A little burnt orange. Very you know? autumnal. And um, I think the thing with all black, I'm a big advocate for all black clothing and a nice all black tracksuit a nice you know black jean black t-shirt black trainer like it's just there's just something so slick and sleek and sophisticated yeah. about it yeah you know what i mean it's chic it's chic it is even like a woman like a, a woman in a knee-high boot with like a black jacket mm -hmm. there's something that it's like gothic <laughs> it's got I've, you know yeah. what i mean parisian parisian well. Ooh. yeah slinky little you know number. what i mean so, so why 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 do you feel like that if it's done well, then I agree. It oh. can look chic and sophisticated. Mm -hmm. But most of the time when I see it, it's done really badly and you just look like a hairdresser. Uh, uh, oh, what? And what is wrong with looking like a hairdresser? Sometimes, actually, I've realised that I come into the show with like an all, all black number or all dark number and I look like a stagehand. Like I'm moving, <laughs> you know, when you're moving, it's the people move the scenery around. between. <laughs> That's what I do worry about that. But I think you can, I mean, Stormzy pulls off pretty much anything that he wears. Agreed? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Oh, thank you. That yeah. would have been awkward if she said, nah, he's, he dresses like a mug. <laughs> <laughs> Weird question. What are you wearing right now? <laughs> oh, Greg. Oh, Greg. <laughs> I'm actually wearing a rainbow jumper. Oh, oh yeah. nice. Yeah. Bit too much colour, probably. Yeah. It's been a great and very weird and popular opinion yeah, today. Has, I've really has, enjoyed it, it, though. Jess, thank you so much. Thanks, Jess. Thank you. Goodbye. Right. Thank you and goodbye. Very, very businesslike. She's off. Stormzy, we're done. One that last thing along. One more. Here we Let's go. Do it. Oh, come, come and tell us your unpopular opinion. Something up to now that you've been scared, scared to say. Hey. Hey. That's a nice <laughs> way to end it. The last hey was... Hey. That was, yeah, that was nice.